When you live in a city, you see all different kinds of buildings. Tall ones and short ones, square ones and curvy ones. But of all the buildings in the city, George's favorite was the George and Steve Super Skyscraping Skyscraper Tower. Hey, that's cute. You two are almost as good at building as bees are. Bees could build things? Where'd they find tools that small? Okay, you build the basics. I'll design the bling. You know, cool stuff so bees will show up quicker. George needed five different parts. A lid, a shallow box, some frames, a grid, and a deeper box. And then George realized he didn't need to build boxes. The apartment was full of them. Yeah. <laughs> they were called drawers. <laughs> now to put everything together. You don't have a bunch of drawers that fit together. Ah. Maybe I should make a model of the beehive. Do you have any scissors? Uh -huh. mm. He did have drawers that fit together. And they came with their own lid. Ah. Kitchen cabinets were practically a one-stop shopping spot for beehive parts. George, what do we use for frames? That was a good question. <gasps> and George had a good answer. They didn't call them frames for nothing. George was just missing one part. Not for long. Fantastic! Now let's put in my improvements. Indoor swimming pool, bowling alley, game room, moon bounce, golf course, movie theater. Oh no, you're right, it's late. Let's drop this at Aunt Margaret's. Then we better work extra hard to drum up bees. <laughs> okay, George. So, uh, how do we drum up bees? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Betsy said bees go from flower to flower. Maybe if their hive had flowers, the bees would move in. Come on, bees. Betsy will be here any mi- ah! Betsy, you're- <laughs> Is this what I think it is? Wait, Betsy, I can explain. See, you said have a taste, so we- <laughs> uh, Just the tiniest slice. And it was yum, and then, where'd it go? So we tried to buy you more, but everyone was out, so we built you a hive instead. You guys, you've done a lot of things, but this, this is absolutely, by far, the best present you've ever given me. It is? Uh -huh. But we ate your honeycomb. Yeah. What? Oh, no. That piece of honeycomb was for you. I've got lots more. What? Huh? Oh, show me how this works. I want to use it in my Earth Day presentation. Sure. Betsy had a hive. Steve and George had more honeycomb. Everyone was happy. Well, almost everyone. Everyone.